Hello and welcome to this course on Terraform. My name is Sijesh. This video we will see how to use count to deploy multiple resources. So in previous videos we have seen how to deploy a single resource using a Terraform configuration file. So we will be using the same file here also and will do some modification. So if you look into this file you can see two sections. One is provider so where we are adding the AWS details and the second one is a resource we are providing that instance detail. So by default this will deploy a single instance in our example it's AWS instance but if we want to deploy multiple resource we can use count and count followed by the number. So if I, here for example I'm writing two so that means two EC2 instances will be created as part of this deployment so once that is done go ahead and save and first thing we need to do is terraform init so this will download the plugins which are needed for the provider and once that is done so we will go ahead and validate this by using terraform validate command you should get a success message to proceed further and then we can uh, see what are the uh, deployment it's going to do using Terraform plan. So Terraform plan won't do the actual deployment. So it will list what how this work. So if you see here, you can see the AWS underscore instance example VM of zero. So that means the first instance name and scroll down a little bit down here. You can see example VM one. So we can go to the AWS console and uh, see is there any instance running, nothing is running. Then we will do deploy that using Terraform apply. Again, it takes some time uh, to do the deployment and it will prompt you to uh, type yes or no. Go ahead and press yes so that it will start the deployment. So you can see two instances are getting created and in AWS console, you can see the same so this takes some time and uh, finally you can see it's completed and uh, resources added two and uh, you can see two uh, in vm with t2 micro has created so once that is done so we can destroy or delete this using terraform destroy function so it takes some time to destroy and uh, so it delete that instance so here also you need to confirm by typing yes you can see the vm0 and vm1 are destroying so that's it uh, for this demo so if you want to deploy multiple resources you can use the count option so count equal to the number and that much resources will be deployed i hope you enjoyed this learning thank you for watching this video so we will see in the next video bye